All right, coming up next, it's a middleweight matchup between Paolo Costa and Robert Whittaker. All right, so we got two classically trained strikers here. Any chance this fight actually goes to the ground? This fight does not go to the ground. This one will be fought in the pocket. Two guys will stand in front of each other. They will trade punches. They will trade kicks. It's going to be a classic matchup that you normally see inside of a ring. We get it in the octagon tonight, guys. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. And they separate. Huge knee lands from close. And now he's got that tie clinch. We'll see what he can do with it. Oh, single collar tie here. Well, he continues to find the openings tonight. Beautiful connection with the punch there. Accuracy at its best. And they separate. Take down here, he gets it. Elbow by Whitaker. All right, so you got to be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't want to mess around for too long. Posturing up now. And now the damage is about to start. If you're the bottom fighter, DC, what do you do? You got to move. You got to shrimp. You got to get off of the hip to try to move your opponent off of you or pull him down to close the space. Scramble and go! Scramble and go! Oh, and he escapes up to his feet. Very nice. Oh, and he lands a knee to the body now, DC. Talk to us about that strike. They suck so bad, especially when you're going forward. You walk full speed into a knee to the body. It could in the night. Big ball punch land. Now we get back to range. And there comes the separation now. Single collar tie now. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Whitaker gets up, he is back on the feet. Looked like he was in a submissive state on the ground, but he worked hard there to get back to the feet. Real sneaky body kick. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are gonna take their toll as this fight goes up. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Big elbow! Wow! Oh! Oh, straight right! Just over 20 total strikes have found the mark for Paolo Costa. Oh! The jab followed by the right hand. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Big knee to the body! Oh! Ooh, what a punch. Tags him with the uppercut. Real nice body kick land. Big, straight left. Oh! How about those five minutes? Right, so there's the end of the round as we show you some of the highlights, DC, and there was a big knockdown. All right, round two now, ladies and gentlemen. Paolo Costa. You ready? And Robert Whitaker. Whitaker gets hit by that kick to the midsection. You gotta do better defensively. Ooh. Oh. All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations. Well, the jab has been looking great. How about jab, jab, right hand? Right. Because eventually you're gonna have to put something on your opponent that's gonna really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working so well, if he drops a big right hand after it, he may be able to finish his fight. He had him hurt. Good look for the judges here. Look how wobbly he is. 
Well, the stats producer's been busy tonight, DC. 49 total oh, strikes. Oh, huge right hand! Whitaker gets up, but the question is for how long he looks wobbly. We have now crossed the midpoint of this one. Oh, he lands another strike to the body. Oh! He's out! He's done, he's done! Oh, my goodness, what a fight. Beautiful shot to end the fight right there. It couldn't have landed much more flush than it did, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, quite frankly. So, near-perfect execution on the strike that ultimately results in the KO here tonight. All right, DC, no Telestrator tonight, boys. Now we go inside the Octagon.